Hey everybody, so we had a good day today. We got to um, enjoy our day at uh, Animal Kingdom and everything we wanted to do, we did. We got uh, back to the... Um, Magic Kingdom? We got back to the Magic Kingdom and we got to see fireworks and we got in a good spot. My wife is, let's just say my wife is vertically challenged. She's, uh, she's kind of a short gal, you know, let's be honest. She's petite. So it's always been a challenge to get her in a spot where she could see fireworks and you know a lot of times people stand in the way or they walk right in front of you and they put their kid on their shoulders and then they're another you know couple feet taller and she's you know short. So her field of vision is not great. Um, we did find a good spot and I think she was able to see quite a bit. Were you able to see more this time than normal? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay so that worked out great. Um, the fireworks were at 9 o'clock tonight. This is October 23rd. October 23rd. Yeah. Um, tomorrow is my stepdad Dan's birthday. Happy birthday, Dan. Love you. Sorry we double booked and scheduled to be out of town. I'm sad. I'll see you soon. Um, I'll make it up to you, buddy. Anyway, um... Tomorrow is our big day. Tomorrow we're going to Epcot and we're going to go to the Food and Wine Festival. And we're really looking forward to trying foods from different lands. Um, our, our, what? Different countries. We're going to try foods from different countries. We're not going to different countries. They're just going to be countries around the World Showcase. And we're going to stop in and be like, oh look, a kiosk. What do you have to eat? And we're going to sample little things for, they have little, little food dishes for, for purchase and some of our um, food plan will take care of that whatever it doesn't we're just gonna pay extra yeah so I work hard right so you can have a good time and get to enjoy the things that you want to try and we're gonna do that um, I would like to say that the new what do you call it happily ever after. the new happily ever after fireworks display and projection thing that they do on the castle is awesome just awesome if you get a chance to see it get a chance you, you may want to make sure you where you can see the castle because the projections and the imagery that they put on the castle is like nothing I've ever seen it was beautiful if you could sum it up in one word what would it be baby no that's not the word I was looking for <laughs> if you could sum it up in one word what would it be Spectacular. Spectacular. See, that's a good word. That's an action word. That's a I like it word. I like it. So, thanks for watching, everybody. Take care. Hey, everybody. So, today is Tuesday, and we are headed to Epcot. We're specifically going to do the Food and Wine Festival. We've never been. We've heard about it. We've heard it's really great, and this will be our first experience doing it. Um, looking forward to it. Uh, we didn't have to be there super early. Because the World Showcase, where the all the countries are located, they're on the, the north end of the park. Uh, they don't open until 11, so we were able to sleep in a little bit. We only have one fast pass today, and that's to do Soarin'. Um, and honestly, if we don't ride anything else, that's okay. We're there to see the countries and get to experience the culture and and enjoy the little kiosks and and visit the little things, the, the little showcases. So, anyway. Uh, I'm going to try and film some of that, and if I don't, I'm sorry, but I'm going to do the best I can. Uh, we're just going to try and drink it all in. So, <clears throat> here we go.